Hey there, everybody. Oh, I'm wearing a scarf. I'm wearing a suit. Okay. Hey there, everybody. Um, I'm wearing a suit because it's a special day at school um, today, which is Wednesday. I'm coming to you from the past, by the way, because I'm not going to have enough time to film this video on Thursday, so I'm coming to you from the past on Thursday, wearing a suit, looking real spiffy, if I do say so myself. Um, today, I want to talk to you about optimism. Optimism is a really interesting thing. See, optimism is taking the good in any situation and heightening that so you don't really pay attention to the bad quite so much. I'm sort of an authority on optimism because I am myself an optimist. Okay, so let's say, we'll, we'll just break up the world into two different parts of people. Over here you got the optimist, and over here you've got the pessimist. Okay, we'll come up with a situation. Oh no! My car broke down on the side of the road! What am I going to do now that my car's broken down on the side of the road? An optimist would be like, Oh well, at least I got my AAA card right here so I can uh, call the AAA people and have them come and bring me to the car repair place where, oh look, I got it on my insurance. Whereas a pessimist would think, It's raining outside right now and I am not having a good time. This is not fun. Ah! Uh, uh, oh no! My car is broken. I'm probably gonna have to pay a ton of money and repairs. Oh! Uh, that was some badly d different people or something. But the point is, the point is, you have your optimists where everything is cheery, and you have your pessimists where everything is awful. Now, I would argue that there is a happy medium, but it is incredibly hard to achieve that, truly. Be the happy medium in that situation, be like, Oh man, it's raining outside today. I better pull out my cell phone and call the 800 number, call for a, a pickup truck. Uh, it totally is a bummer that this is happening, but at least I got my pickup truck on the way to drive me back. Now, um, that completely different accent for some reason is the happy medium that is hard to completely achieve. See, most of the time we find ourselves in moods, and you're either in a good mood or a bad mood, an optimistic mood or a pessimistic mood. It's hard to find yourself, say you're in a pessimistic mood, and you get an F on your test. Now, if you're in a pessimistic mood already, you're going to be pessimistic about this test. You're going to be like, oh no, this is going to ruin my grade point average forever, and my parents are going to hate me. Everything's awful, and your neck goes away. Whereas if you're an optimist, you're all like, oh, oh man, I got an F. I got an F, but I'm in an optimistic mood. So you know what? I'm going to take that F, constructive criticism, and not fail my next test. If you're already in an optimistic mood, you'll be optimistic. And if you're in a pessimistic mood, you can be a pessimistic. But it's hard to be like, aw, shucks, I got an F. This is really poopy. My mom's going to hate me for this. But next time, I will do at least a B plus. And you know what? That kind of feeling is hard to master. I haven't mastered it, and most people haven't mastered it. Most people are either really upset that they got an F on test, or really optimistic, oh, next time I'll do better. Or a lot of people are either, ah oh, man, my car broke down and everything is hopeless, or, ah, oh, it's okay, it's okay. I mean, I got a tow truck coming and the insurance is gonna take care of it. I mean, I find myself leaning toward this side. I'm, I, I have a hard time finding the bad in situations. And I know a lot of people who can only find the bad side in situations, have find a hard time finding the good. And it's all a matter of perspective. And it has a lot to do with the moods that we already set ourselves in. I've been in bad moods before. But when I'm in a bad mood, I do realize that I'm in a bad mood and try to move myself more to that happy medium in the middle. And if I'm in an excessively happy mood and other people are, you know, not happy, I try to move myself to the middle as well. Anyway, that's all I've got. But I have one more thing I need to tell you. I'm winning!